Welcome back to First Step 4 continues where I'm taking a look from our Thurman Dam Cam looking down the Savannah River and we actually have uh, two people out here just casting the rod trying to see if they can maybe reel something in before the sun does set. Uh, definitely on the cooler side, but they are out there getting to it and maybe this is good fishing conditions. I'm sure our chief meteorologist could uh, share some insight on that. 56 though right now, the current temperature out there. So like I said, it's on the cooler side and those winds out of the north at about six. So not overly breezy for us. As far as current temperatures, we do find those in the 50s area wide still, but we are going to see these temperatures falling pretty quickly once that sun does set here in less than an hour. As far as temperatures for tomorrow morning waking up, a lot of us are going to be right around the freezing mark, which is 32 degrees. Some of us could be just below that in those lower 30s and maybe even a few upper 20s, but expecting to see more of those low 30s for tomorrow as we'll see those temperatures just a smidge warmer than what they were this morning. As far as looking at course conditions for tomorrow, those temperatures do move from those upper 20s and low 30s towards about 60 for tomorrow. So it'll be a tad bit warmer as well, uh, but still on the cooler side and below average for this time of year. We do have a big meteor shower that peaks tomorrow night. This is one of the biggest meteor showers of the year, if not the biggest, uh, meaning that you will have a pretty good opportunity to see a decent amount of meteors, especially if you live in a more rural area away from light pollution from the city. Also, it's going to be the new moon in terms of the phase of the moon, which means that uh, essentially at nighttime is going to be very dark because the moon will not be present. So pretty good viewing conditions for this shower. Even if you live inside the city limits, still the potential to see a few of these per hour. Uh, as far as the frost and freeze forecast, though we are going to see these temperatures staying above freezing for your Thursday morning back down to maybe hard freeze thresholds for your Friday morning a little bit milder for those starts as we head towards the weekend with rain pushing in by Sunday back to that storm in Tennessee where